good morning. It's about 7.40 probably and I'm out in the car park of the Travel Lodge. I have checked out and I have um, got them to phone me a taxi which was no problem. The, there was a sort of slight problem which we're going to sort of discover shortly I think and that is that uh, bizarre he's chuffering away to himself that guy down there um, and that is that there are two train stations <laughs> I said to uh, the lady will you please order me a taxi for the train station and she said east or west and I said um, and I said, whichever one is the main one, because obviously it's a Sunday and I don't want to be stuck in a tiny little, you know, if East Canterbury is a huge station and West Canterbury is a little dot on the map, I don't want to be stuck at a place that isn't going to be doing trains to London, because then I'll need to get another taxi from one station to the other, which is going to really annoy me. Um, so, there we are. Anyway, she said the taxi is on its way, and it identifies me... Uh, not through my name, but through my room number, which is room 101. Well, there's good news and there's bad news. The good news is there's a train that leaves for London from Canterbury East, uh, which is where I am, at one minute past eight. And it's now probably about quarter to eight, which is good. The bad news is, it's not going to King's Cross St Pancras, it's going to London, Victoria. Which isn't a problem, so to speak, because I, I know where I am. My, my worry is, and this shouldn't matter, it shouldn't matter. I've got a, a, a travel uh, card and, uh, for London, and my only problem is that it says that the start place is London, King's Cross and I'm just a little worried that any other station on the underground isn't going to let me in with the card even though once I'm in with the card I can go wherever I want. Hopefully that, that turns out to be complete nonsense because um, uh, you can go anyway it's, it's a day card but I, but I have to say that is a worry. Um, if that turns out to be the problem it doesn't matter because I'll just get a single which is only two pounds to uh, in fact, I might do that anyway. I might get a single to London's King, London King's Cross, go to King's Cross, and then use my travel car from there. Sad, but there we are. The other thing, which is a little bit of annoy, uh, annoying, I don't know, is um, that there was a person on the ticket desk, but there's no person sort of around here to ask about uh, off-peak time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to risk... I'm going to get on the train, and then if there's a problem, I'm just going to, uh, well, well, frankly, I'm going to lie, and I'm going to tell them that it, that the uh, people at the station said it was okay to use. <laughs> it's a bit naughty, but uh, there we are. Um, and finally, uh, it looks like this particular train may not be the fast train. It may go um, sort of around a few few stops first so it could be longer I, I don't think it will be um, hours and hours and hours because we, we, we just are not that far from London um, so even if it's sort of going if it has a few stops on the way I'm hoping it's not going to be more than an hour um, but the thing is there's no taxi rank outside to uh, to get me to Canterbury West and the the guy in the taxi said as he was dropping me off oh said um I think uh, it's the um that all the fast trains go from Canterbury West oh well thanks for telling me that after you dropped me off but there we are taxi was only five pounds because Canterbury East is literally just beyond the castle now had I known that I could have walked here um even last night and found out uh, all the information that I needed to um so there we are. So anyway, we're going to catch the 801 train to London from Canterbury East. Hope that it's not too long. Hope that our ticket's okay to use on this train. And then probably get a single ticket to uh, on the underground to um, King's Cross. 
unless we're feeling brave and unless we ask the uh, there might be ticket people to ask actually at um, at Victoria about whether we can start our journey on the London Underground via our uh, our data, uh, our sort of uh, zone one to four day pass uh, at London Victoria, whether we have to go all the way to King's Cross to start again. Um, and that's really how I know this is the wrong station because all the others I'm sure went to King's Cross, uh, even though actually the ticket is just Canterbury stations to London terminals. I know that the, the ticket that we planned, the train that we planned on using, left from a station and went to London King's Cross because that is where. Uh, we had to put down the um, start position for the London Underground. So anyway, there we are. So now I'm uh, on board the train, and they tell me there's only nine stops between here and Victoria. We've already announced the first stop, although we haven't stop there yet um, and we've only been on the train about two or three minutes so hopefully um, hopefully it's not going to be too long a journey no sign of a ticket man yet though hmm I hope this is off P Thank you.